everybody. Hello, hello everyone. This is Bernie from Stampin' Eat. I was just busy um, getting my rubber stamps sorted from my box that arrived this afternoon. And I thought, hey, why don't I make a quick video and show you how these arrive and what you do to put them together because I know when I was still a new stamper when these arrived I had no clue so I just want to make it easy for you so this is the beautiful whimsical tree stamp set that comes as part of the whimsical suite if you order it and I've already labeled my dies whimsical tree die pairs with whimsical trees and they look like that and this is going to be I'm going to be playing with that this weekend but that's not the purpose of the video so as you can see you um, have your picture on the outside with what your stamps look like and when they arrive it arrives with this being loose so as you can see I've already done a couple which is when I thought oh I should show you what to do so and you've got your labels that are loose so what I do is I always take this out first of all I set it to the side and I make sure I am placing the die in the same position as what I'm placing the um, label and if you look carefully hopefully you, there we go there we go there's a separation on the one side so what I do is I pull off the, um, oops just be careful you don't pull the entire stamp out so now you've got that bit exposed the corresponding die is that one so you push that out you just give it a tug and you will notice it's got a backing on the back so that comes off and then let me just make sure this is in the camera because I'm going to need to aim it um, put it carefully you make sure you line it up the best you can push it down firmly not too firmly but just firmly enough and then you oh that one's a bit skew and then you literally are going to peel it off now that's probably because I wasn't standing right on top of it I am not going to fiddle with that because I have previously mucked up a stamp horrifically by doing that the only thing that this is going to mean is that I have to be very careful when I stamp this particular image and I will need to um, stamp it off first so that I can eyeball it. Let me try that again and see if I can do that one more time for you properly. So you separate, get those bits off. It's always a way when you know something's recording you because it goes fine now <laughs> but now that I'm having this recording it makes you a little bit nervous so I'm just going to come in excuse my head if that's in the camera so right over there pull it off there we go much better and there it is and you continue doing this you pull off all your stamps until they are all done and then at the back of that you will see that actually comes off as well you glue it onto the base and then you pop your stamp sets back in and let me just show you so I've just bought um, a grandkid now that well I've been a grandparent two and a half years but the set and the new catalog had exactly the words I was looking for so there you can see I've done this set with um, this one and all of them are popped in there so that is just a quick and easy video to show you what you do when you get the red rubber stamps as a stamp set and you haven't a clue if you are a brand new stamper i hope you found that helpful thanks a lot see you next time remember stamp eat sleep repeat bye